go ahead and test that out right now and see how it does. I'm gonna connect it up here to my Ford. So port is not open. So what we have to do is you have to come in here to the Tesla, click on open charge port right there. Charge port will open up. And again, I'm just using my Ford portable charger connected to a 240 outlet. Let's see what we got going on here. Comes in a fancy, comes in a fancy little bag here and you got to drop it first because that's the cool thing to do. Go ahead and stick the adapter in first is kind of what, what I advise to do there. That way the charge port stays open because it'll actually close it after a little bit. Then we just stick the little charger on there. Goes green and it's going to be charging. Look at that. Adapter works out great. And let's see what speed it actually charges it. See so coming here. On that charging at this location, I set it to 90% and it's doing 30 amps because that's what it was. And then saying it's going to be seven hours remaining, it's charging at 19 miles per hour, so about 20 miles an hour. So we're looking at about seven, six to seven kilowatt hours per hour.